late 80s, early 90s, Jason Everman was a guitarist for a local Seattle band that was starting to gain in popularity called Nirvana. As they were touring in 1989, Kurt Cobain thought of Jason as a little too moody. Jason soon left Nirvana and joined another up-and-coming band called Soundgarden, but he was kicked out of that band after a few months before their breakout albums were released. So not long after, Jason decided to take a major departure from the grunge music scene and join the army. As with everything he does in life, he put 110% effort into being a soldier. He became a U.S. Army Ranger and eventually a Special Forces Operator, serving multiple tours in Iraq and Afghanistan. Here are three leadership lessons that we can learn from his story. First, resilience. After being let go from both Nirvana and Soundgarden, Jason could have easily been consumed by bitterness and regret. Instead, he channeled his energy into finding and succeeding in a new path. Second, commitment to purpose. Jason went all in with everything he did, from excelling in his musical craft to serving in the special forces. His commitment to purpose led to his major accomplishments. And third, humility. Despite having been part of two major rock bands, Jason didn't want to capitalize on his fame when he was in the military. He preferred to just being another soldier in the ranks. Jason Everman's life served as an example of a multifaceted nature of leadership. His story is a testament to the fact that leadership lessons can be found in the most unexpected places and that it's never too late to change paths and find a new way to lead and inspire. Thank you for listening to another episode of Bite Size Leadership. I'm Tim Huff.